everyone, thanks for tuning in. Today I'm going to show you how I fixed my MacBook Air. This is a really easy fix. Um, it's actually something that you can just pop online and look up yourself and chat with an Apple support rep about. But I figured I'd pop on to show you this because a lot of people like to watch YouTube tutorials and how to fix things as opposed to going through all those steps online yourself. So the issue that I had with my laptop, um, and it's a MacBook Air, and this happens with even MacBook Pros and all those kind of things, but I closed my laptop and when I opened up the next time, which is literally like an hour later, all of a sudden the fan started going on high. Like it sounded like it was processing everything on my computer. It sounded like it was going to overheat my computer and explode it, which I was not cool with. Um, and funnily enough, in the top right hand corner of my MacBook, the battery status indicator was not even there. Like it didn't even show up, which I thought was weird. And this is actually what the fan sounded like. And I tried putting my laptop in sleep mode and then shutting it down. And every time I shut it down, the fan would stop. But when I opened it again or restarted it, the fan would keep going on high. So it turns out that you can do a quick diagnostic on your computer. You want to power off your laptop. And when you turn it back on, press and hold the D button. It's going to come up with some automatic prompts on how to run the diagnostic. And it only takes a few minutes. And from there, this is the message that I got. I took the screen capture with my phone and it came up with two possible issues. The battery status or the battery and the SMC. So I took these two reference codes, I popped online to Apple Chat and I told the rep about the problems that I was having and they said it's probably a problem with the SMC so these are the steps that you want to take and it should fix the problems. So what you'll want to do is power down that laptop. Once that is powered down you're going to plug in the source to a power supply and then simultaneously you want to hold down shift control, option, and the power button. And then once you remove that or let go of them, then you should see your MagSafe charger go from no light to a green light to an orange light indicating that it is charging. So that's exactly what happened on mine. And then when I opened up my laptop, the fan sound wasn't running and it was running normally. You couldn't hear it. And in the top right of the screen, as you can see, my battery status indicator was back up and running. It literally took me less than five minutes to solve once I actually popped online to the Apple's chat support um, and they told me what to do. So everything's running fine. If you guys are experiencing the same kind of issue, it's probably the problem with your SMC. Do the exact same steps that I just told you here and hopefully it works for you. And if not, you're probably going to have to take it into a genius bar to get looked at. So I hope that little tip helped you out. Don't forget to thumbs up this video if you liked it or if you had the same problem and this little button thingy ended up helping you and making your laptop work again. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more random videos from me. And don't forget to visit www.doitlikedolly.com where I post recipes and other crafts and things that don't actually make it to this YouTube channel. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye! So there you have it. This took literally under a minute to do. Uh, the great thing is you don't have to spend time peeling it away with your fingers, which takes a lot more time and it makes them kind of stinky. I personally like the smell of garlic, so I don't mind how my hands smell after, but um, 